Hello everyone, this is Daniel speaking from behind the camera and this is an unboxing review, I guess a part of however many parts of uh, an unboxing showing to you my new WRX. So that's a this is a 2022 Subaru WRX Sport, that's the trim level and it's a six-speed manual. So this is the Canadian version, slightly different trim level namings, different nomenclature than the US spec. And uh, again, in Canada, they are called uh, WRX Sport. And uh, this is the mid trim level. This is approximately equivalent to the US Premium, but I believe it does have some extras such as the blind spot monitoring and uh, sunroof coming standard on this trim level. This trim level is 37,700, so 37,700 Canadian dollars plus uh, tax, GST and PST on top of that. Anyways, just wanted to give you some impressions here of the exterior. So it is still wrapped fresh from Japan. So let's look around it. It's just a tight squeeze between the cars. See the hood scoop is wrapped here. It's got the truck deck, deck right there. Top is wrapped. You can see the rear view mirror where the, um, I believe this is for the self dimming functionality of the rear view mirror. Beautiful ignition red. And the lovely back. Everyone loves this bumper, of course. I might actually get an exhaust finisher piece to finish off these exhausts. It's an aluminum piece. I'm just not exactly sure how it would look with the uh, the red because the uh, black and red actually complement each other quite well. So this is what they look like. That's that's how they come from Japan, from the factory. So let's explore some more. Got this key with us. It's our stock number. And we have the carpet mats. So when they come from the factory, they just have the uh, mats in the back. And then our technicians at the dealership will put them in. Very spacious cargo area. Pretty nice interior, nice for a Subaru, definitely has improved over the years. Beautiful large screen, very comfortable interior, look at the sunroof as well. This is the mid trim level, so it's got a power seat, but it is a cloth seat. I do have the blind spot monitoring system right here. Other than that, everything's automatic, automatic headlights. It's got heated seats as well. It's all con controlled through the screen. So that's that's how the seats are protected from factory, but I'll give you a peek. Nice, awesome, smells like a new car. It's got the right number of pedals. From Japan. To Canada and also new for the 2022 versus the previous model 2021 and prior the sport trim level has the um, uh, the chargers in the back 2.1 amp chargers USB chargers in the back and then the sport tech has those buttons to the side filled out and those would be heated seats, rear heated seats. That's only on the Sportec, which is the uh, top of the line. I believe that's equivalent to the US spec limited. So that's what we're talking about here. This model has uh, increased in interior space in every dimension other than the rear headroom. There's like a few millimeters less, really not much less, but more leg room, car's a little wider, a tiny bit longer, handles great, drives great, 
and I think I'll cap it here. Um, I have to wait for the dealership to PDI the car and clean it, unwrap it, get it ready for me and should be picking it up tomorrow and I'll continue the series from there. Thanks for checking my WRX out. Have a good one.